Spurs restore without juice. Sorry for the inconvenience. <laughs> I'm about to put it back in the oven. Powder my onion granules. Like three Brazil. Yo, what's up, is it Nelly Chopper? <laughs> Know what I'm saying? NLE Shuffle, whatever you want to call me. Um, and we are making hamburger helpful. We making things that's coming together. Alkaline, and that's the way for the world. It'll be forever. You dig? You know, a little short, a little freestyle or whatnot, what it is. Get the goddamn mosquito away from me. Somebody close the door. Um, anyway, you know what I'm saying? We finna make a flatbread, fennel flatbread, with homemade cheese, homemade marinara. Sausage and fennel. God damn, yeah, she just slide through sausage and fennel flatbread. My bad, you know what I'm saying? We're gonna make the sausage from scratch out of mushrooms, um, walnuts, and um, even chickpeas. And then we're gonna season it like meat. Man, it's gonna all come together perfectly and divinely. Y'all gonna see. And for all the people that look at these, look at these cook videos we making and look at it and be like, hmm, it looks good. I wonder, does it really? taste like this or does it taste like a substitute because it's vegetables i just want to let y'all know it do you know it does trust me 100 percent. i was um i wasn't vegan my whole life i wasn't alkaline my whole life i was 16 years eating meat and dairy so i know how meat and dairy taste so all of these replacements that we doing i promise it's spot on hands on i be feeding it to people that still eat meat or still eat dairy or whatnot and they be letting me know like yo it's on point it's even better you know what I'm saying? It's just harder for people to make that transition because they think it's hard, but we finna show you how easy it really is. You just gotta prepare. You know what I'm saying? Prepare. Preparation. You know what I'm saying? I'm extremely excited. I could keep talking about it forever, but I feel like I'm talking too long. So as you see, as you know, let's go. So now we are boiling some Brazil nuts. You could either boil them or soak them overnight. Boil them for about, you know, 10, 20 minutes or so. And uh, yeah, so we're gonna wait for those to pull. So for the sausage, we're gonna use um, different spices. We're gonna list the spices we're using. So we're gonna use about two cups of chickpeas, about a cup of walnuts. I boiled the walnuts for like 10 minutes before. And about two cups of portobello mushrooms. And we're just gonna blend all these up together. Sorry for the inconvenience. <laughs> so we're gonna add some of the marinara. Before we add the marinara, explain, cause we kinda already made it, so y'all didn't see. Yeah, so we use um, this tomato sauce. They use organic Roma tomatoes. It's my favorite tomato sauce. Spicy also. This would be real good too because it'll give another seasoning to the meat already before it even hit the pizza. Yeah. Tastes like candy, sweet like fruit. Ooh. Okay. Yeah, we working. <laughs> we a food processor would have did right, but yeah, uh, you really supposed to use a food processor, but. And that, my girl. So this is our meat. Now, I know you're looking at this like, what in the fucking throw up is this shit? But, watch how we shape this shit. That had to be meat, my nigga. <laughs> I'm be bigger than your meat at home, little homie. What? <laughs> you hear me, man? <laughs> I'm saying, you gonna shape that motherfucker. Most of you protein lovers need to take a sip of this shit. Real shit might help you. It doesn't look like what y'all be drinking anyway. Spurs restore without the juice. We'll be strong as hell in the kitchen just making shit. <laughs> just, just making a Hercules Supreme juice and shit. Shaking it up. Now after this, I'm gonna lift 10 tons of weights. <laughs> <laughs> That's how they be. After this, I bet you can bench press an 18-wheeler. That'd be a giant baby. 
nothing. Three. Look at that thing go. Insane pigs, dude. <laughs> okay, so now we're going to add our blended mixture in a bowl and add the seasonings and our flour. Um, so we need one of them. So now we're going to take our blended mixture and we're going to put it in the bowl and add our flour and seasonings. So. <laughs> it smells like shit. It does. Let's see if this one can be good. Where that came out? Well, you know, sausage is just ground it up. Yeah, for sure. Meat. All the meat people know. Yep. If you really eat meat, well, if you really process meat, the people that be in them meat grinding companies, they know. This how, it, this how it looks. But I'm gonna tell y'all something about the meat grinding people. Um, it be a whole lot of extra shit in their meat that they don't tell y'all about. They got an ND, they got to sign NDAs and shit. You know what I'm saying? To make sure like some of this stuff. No, actually, you can actually just look up the FD, FDA approved shit that can go with meat. You will find many stuff like plastic and lead and all that type of shit. Like, for real. For real, for real. Human meat, you know. For real. So, them little kids, little Timmy on that milk carton y'all been looking for, he damn near in that McDonald's 12 piece you just ordered, 10 piece, whatever it is. No, for real, because they found human meat in one of McDonald's human, I mean, meat disposals before. I don't want to stick my hand all the way in there, though. Just look at my hand. I gotta go get nasty with him. <laughs> yeah. Look at me. Did you take it out? <laughs> like, you know, go get it. Take that motherfucker out. <laughs> <laughs> that motherfucker in there, too, bro. That's a lot, bro. This is great. You gonna think this shit looks so nasty, but wait till they see the final product. Ooh, that bitch is shitting on me. Look at my foot, folks. Oh, you know. Um. What do you say? What's that TikTok sound? <laughs> <laughs> what sound? What time I said? Yeah, that's what you're talking about. That's what you're talking about, right? When you said that. Epic can barely get that. <laughs> You can barely get that. Oh. <laughs> you can barely get that. This shit was funny as hell. I am hood with it. If this whole thing was to fall on the floor right now, on God, I'm scooping all this up. And if y'all don't want to eat it, I'm going to eat it. Because that shit just took so fucking long to grind up. <laughs> <laughs> that shit just took so long, bro. Hey, should I mix it up? I should mix it. Yeah, mix. I should beat it. For the Beat it up. Oh, we can make we can chicken. Add. I mean, we can make beef burgers. We can put this in. Oh. Side seasonings. We're going to list the seasonings and measurements below. Just look at that. Won't you look at this? Won't you look at this? It's a half pint film, bitch. Who tell that is? It's a half pint film, bitch. Oh. Now look at this shit we just got. Look at this shit we just got out of the toilet and seasoned. <laughs> oh, what this supposed to be? Sausage. This is sausage. That's the sausage that you said you were gonna make? Mm -hmm. Look gonna be like patties? Mm -mm. No, it's gonna be like ground sausage. It's gonna look like. I don't taste it. 
This is gonna be um, cool. And then we're gonna add about a teaspoon of liquid smoke. Ooh wee. To give it that nice smoky barbecue cool. flavor. Oh no, I didn't know. So now I'm about to add, uh, I cut up some red peppers, green peppers, white onions, and some shallots. Look how she cut it up though. Like, <laughs> perfect. <laughs> she like pico de gallo. I'm gonna add that in there. I mix it. And then we're gonna add um, about three, three or four tablespoons of flour. You can use chickpea flour or teff flour for gluten free. Or you can use stout flour. Yeah. If you don't care. Yeah. Oh. T E F. -E -F -E. Yeah, we use that for injera for yeah, Ethiopian injera. food. Yeah. I tried to make some injera. I made hot. a really good Ethiopian dinner. Was you for real? I think I saw it on your page. It was so good. Did it, you it post it? Yeah. You it, 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 uh -huh. it didn't look the best because you know it's like. Yeah. Like it's to enjoy. You know what I'm saying? Like the mm -hmm. the platter. So we're gonna add. Chickpea flour. That's about right. a tablespoon. Yeah, salad's getting in my eye. Oh, this shit. Getting flashbacks. And then I'm gonna add some spell flour. So we do spell and chickpea. I'm, I'm just doing that today, but you can, you can. The flour is just a binder. Um, to help everything stick. Yeah, everything stick together. We should add a little agave, huh? Yeah. Ooh, I forgot agave. And add a little bit, about a teaspoon of agave. A little more. A teaspoon and a half. But yeah, just add a little bit of flour. And form the patty. You really, um... Should let it sit in the refrigerator for like an hour or two, but we're not doing that. So, <laughs> <laughs> so it can really like get cold and like firm up. So just want to put about a half a cup of the mixture. You're gonna take a some parchment paper and just start rolling it. Da da da! I'm blowing some over. A lot of you niggas shouldn't have a problem doing that part. <laughs> and no CJ shouldn't. Smoking ass nigga. Smoking bleep bleep. We're gonna ground it. <laughs> We're gonna ground it anyway, but I'm just showing you. Bro, I ain't gonna lie. We doing. can make some cheeseburgers out of that too, fool. Oh, yeah. Like, if we wasn't making it in burger form. Her nappy, hell nap, boy. And wait to get my hair cut and my hair done. Then when we gonna do the rasta pasta. Cause I'm gonna be rasta chopper. And then for sausage patties, obviously, all you have to do is make it into a sausage. Um, that's I ain't gonna lie. It's perfect. I wish I could taste it for real. Like it's perfect. We we just season the hell out of this, and um, we got the exact taste we're looking for. It's perfect. I promise. Like you can really eat it like this if you really want. Honestly, <laughs> like it's perfect. So yeah. Right. Now I'm gonna heat up a little bit of avocado oil. Mm. 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 Avocado oil. Yeah. Our mixture is pretty much good and seasoning. What you wanna do? <clears throat> Sorry. What you wanna do is taste it. What you think? Delicioso. Delicioso. <laughs> um, so yeah, what you want to do is taste it because whatever it tastes like is going to be what it tastes like when you cook it. Oh God. And remember kids, say no to drugs. <laughs> Play says. Niggas just feel like saying it. I don't know why. I'm just trying to make it funny a little bit. I'm just trying to put some, put some comedy in the cooking. You know what I'm saying? Also, speak to your food. I forgot. This food. This meal will be luxurious. Luxur What's the word? Lux luxurious. Luxurious. This meal is beautiful. This meal is better than meat. This will come out perfect and divine. This will sit well on my stomach and allow more room for more food today, buddy. This 
is life. This is health. This is wealth. This is everything good. This is everything great. Um, so now we're going to make the Brazil nut cheese. So I have about a cup of Brazil nuts in here. Maybe like a cup and a half. And we're going to add some walnut milk. Probably about a half a cup or so. Some oregano, basil, onion powder. That's our favorite. Of onion powder. Yeah. So I love onion powder and sea salt. Then the first Presentation. Yeah. Oh, so we got a lot, right? Yeah. So as you can see, you can either do you a little sausage patty or like a sausage link and fry it for about a minute on each side. Whoops. Welcome to Good Burger. I don't want a Good Burger. Flip it over like so. You see how it's getting real nice and salty. If we put that shit on your plate, you gonna eat that? Yeah. 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 Yeah.